This is Twit. So are we going to talk about, let's see, AR and AR core? Because there was sure. some really uh, TechCrunch. Uh, did they, they were playing with some Apple AR stuff. And so I was like, <gasps> they were talking about AR selfies. I don't know if you saw that. Yeah. And so that's one of the things that will be coming in the new iPhone we hear. Yes. AR and core just, is, is Google's dumbed down version of Tango. See, Google's been ahead of this game mm -hmm. with Tango. But the problem is to do Tango, you need a certain hardware platform. AR kit so successful that Google has unveiled AR Core, which is similar, not exactly the same thing, but the idea is it makes it easier for developers to take advantage. And you've seen, uh, we've shown this, but you may have seen these, these demo videos. Tango requires a significant hardware, and of course you've got to talk phone companies into putting that hardware in. To date, only the Asus Zen phone is a consumer-grade tango platform but ar core does not so it'll work on almost anything you know modern the pixels samsung galaxy s8 as long as you're running 7.0 or higher so suddenly, not, oh, i was gonna ask because i was a little confused is every device going to be ar core certified or do you, you just have to have some it's like ar all? kit so apple's ar kit goes down to i think the iphone 5 or 5s uh, mm -hmm. This is kind of similar AR core. You just have to you have to have Android seven, which is in most okay. cases means a fairly modern Android handset. But you don't need any special hardware, which means it's not going to be as good as Tango. Right, no, but, but it's a toy to play with. Learn and uh, here's some if examples. You could, if you can only get Tango on one device or two devices, right? You know. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, it's I, awesome, but you can't have it. It's hard to it's hard to know. I think this is Google. It's a little preemptive strike from Google because the iPhone, with uh, you know the new iPhone will be coming out September twelfth or announced September twelfth. We think now, so that's two weeks. That's a week from Tuesday, two weeks from yesterday. And the new Pixel. Pixel. We have a date. I don't know how you know accurate this date. It's not a it's not an official date, but somebody said October fifth. Let me see if I can find that article. It's on the rundown. Last year, uh, yeah, here it is from Android Police. Last year, Google tried to get it out before Apple's announcement. This year, I guess they figured, well, what are you going to do? Yeah. Because Apple's is on September 12th. Right. 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 